What's up, everybody? This is Crypto Muscle. Coming to you with another YouTube video and uh, the fake lasers, the gimmicks, Jamaican hair rays, brr, 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 and so much more. It's what it's all about. Platforms, music, news, podcast. Got it all right here on the Crypto Muscle Network. It's all in the description all you gotta just click in that description where it says show more and you see it all everything that i do on the crypto muscle network so here we are latest in cgi trading as today um well probably about say about uh shoot maybe 11 hours ago, 10 to 11 hours ago from the time of this video, uh, my plan expired and I completed yet another cycle. All right. And so, um, this is where I am. I stand with it right now. So right now, let me just go to the deposit list. We're going to get straight to it today, huh? So... My recent plan ended again, 5,000, and, uh, you know, net profit, this this is all that's been done so far, all right, I've completed 10 cycles now, and now the question is, do I go in for an 11th cycle, and the question to answer is, uh, yes, I'm just going to just keep doing it until the wheels fall off all right and so that's what i'm doing and uh, we'll find out if it's going to keep going and flowing so first thing i'm going to do is go back in for five i'm actually thinking yeah you know what i'm, I'm going to go back in for five and then we're going to see i got something else in mind Maybe on the next cycle, we'll th we'll see how things go here. So, from the balance, right, put five thousand back in, and then reinvestment of the balance complete. All right, so it's three percent, seven days, and um, that's daily for seven days, and it's a ten day turnaround. So that's the thing about it. it's a ten day turnaround. So um you know the weekends don't count that's another thing as well so that's why it's like a it feels like a 10-day turnaround and it is <laughs> and so with that what i've been doing is doing a mid cycle update and then the end of the cycle slash new cycle update and so um Based on everything that's been going on with this, the comments I've been reading and things like that, um, I want to say to the comments I've been reading, just reconnect with support and see if that can be squared away. Because I'm, I'm just, you know, no one special except just trying to make it here with this platform. And... Just reconnect with support, you know, try to chat with them or write to support, you know, either way to try to see if you could, you know, hammer out any sort of things that may be happening for you. And for me personally, um, you know, when it comes to the withdrawals and things like that, uh, things have been withdrawing and then Sometimes it could be a little bit slower than the time frame, but in the end, it's still been paying. So, you know, I can't knock it if it's still paying, right? And right now it still is for the moment. And so that's why I keep it going and flowing. For uh, anybody else that's checking it out, it's really up to you to decide if this is something that you want to do, just like in anything else, all right? Um, for right now, I'm just going to just keep it going and flowing and some questions were asked, right? So I didn't accumulate any other sort of amounts this past 
week, except just all in Tether. Uh, and then the Tether Tron. The other amounts, these are too small to take out $3 or $2. The last go around, I had a little bit of Tron earned and a little bit of Bitcoin. I was able to withdraw those out, uh, a little bit of this out. And there was a cap on withdraws. And it's just so it doesn't drain their trading fund and all that. So I only could do little bits at a time. And so that's why you've been seeing me do it in these amounts that you see. So that's where it's at. And it's still within the 48 hour time frame. Uh, these past few days, um, when I tried to do a withdraw from the last video, like I said, the Bitcoin came through and then they had to reset this as they had to do a little bit of a maintenance type of thing. But they said that um, in the upcoming days, they're going to raise, they're going to be able to raise the max withdrawals that you could pull out uh, to the, to what cap? I'm not sure. But that's just what I was asking. Hey, when are you going to be able to w raise the withdrawal, you know, limits? And some people have asked about that too. So uh, that's what I was told that for right now, that's where I, what I can do. And that's all I can do for the moment. But they said they're going to raise it in the upcoming days. So we'll find out, um, you know, if that's going to be the case. And so with that, this is where we are now. So, uh, oh, going back to the deposit list now. So I'm back in for another active plan. Just started again. Completed 10 cycles. Now I'm back in for 11. And this is just cumulative. All right. So if you see this here, this is overall cumulative since I first started. I started back in May and it's been ongoing until now. So this is where it's at. 5,000 again back in and you know just going from here if I start seeing some sort of maybe progression maybe I might kind of compound it back up a little bit more and what do I mean by that well this is how it is all right so you put it into one of these plans let's just say yeah CGI advantage right within this uh, specified deposit uh, frames here. You have fifty dollars to forty nine ninety nine. Explora five thousand to fifteen thousand. CGI Max fifteen thousand and one to one hundred fifty five thousand. So I have those. All right, these are all deposit returns. So you can see the total return that you get from it. The first hundred percent in each of these plans is um, your deposit included. And then what you get with the other smaller percentages, your pure profit, 11.55, 21%, 35% pure profit within those seven days, uh, seven day trading plans here. Uh, then you have CGI Affinity, 25% daily, CGI Bullish, 15.5% weekly for eight weeks, 45% monthly for 24 months for the dynamics. And this one, there is an early out clause too. You don't have to be locked in for the full 24 months. I think you got to be minimum for this three months. You got to be minimum and then there's an out, but you got to pay a, a fee to get out early. And so I think that's why you do three months minimum. So at least it's paying the fee uh, to, to cover that. And you still make a little bit of profit out of it. And so from here, um, how do you compound up? So, for example, I put in 5,000 and then I netted, you saw down below earlier when I was doing a withdrawal, right? There was $2,000 balance extra. I could have just thrown all that back in, make it a $7,000 plan, and then continue up, right? So that's a strategy that you can do. And that's what I was kind of doing in the beginning. Uh, I'd started with 500, went to 1,000, and then I went to 1,500. And I kind of built it up, and then I made a big jump to 5,000. So I'm kind of debating, um, 
you know, whether or not I should compound maybe an extra thousand into it, because it's just going to increase my daily earnings. And then, um, you know, over time I'll get bigger profit. But at the same time, you know, I'm taking on additional risk because I'm putting in a bigger deposit now. And so that's uh, an idea that's come to mind, but we'll see what happens with it. Um, for right now, I just want to see how everything's going and if it's uh, staying on track as it's supposed to do. And if it does, we'll see. We'll revisit it, all right? Maybe on the next cycle or two or so, and we'll see what happens. But all I can do right now is just take it a day at a time and uh, we'll go on from there. So, yeah, these are the plans here. No PDF this time. Last couple of videos I did were kind of like, um, you know, they had PDF talk into it. But this is just giving you a straight up update and details of what is going on, what I'm doing, what I'm doing in this cycle, and what I'm doing possibly going forward. We'll see what happens. And so for right now, this is all I can do right now. And we go from there. So let's go back to the dash. So you can see this is what we got here. And we'll see if this thing meets within the time frame. But it's pretty cool though, because I'm making 150. Usually I don't like to talk about that stuff, but I'll let it speak for itself, all right? Because I don't like to say, oh, this is what I make a day, but this is what it's showing, uh, what you make, you know, per day on it. I'll show you here. Oh, it doesn't show this one. Let me show you a past plan with that. The last cycle. So this is the last cycle, right? So you can see from the 23rd, that was a Friday. So you didn't earn off that Friday. And then that was a Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, right? Today's Wednesday just, just expired a few hours ago. So, you know, you just want to keep the, the, the flow continuously going. So here, uh, this is where it's at. And then it ended at seven in the morning. This is their time. I'm not sure what time zone they're in, but um, that's their time, 7.08. So now when I make a redeposit, uh, let's see what the active plan is. So it's, yeah. It's now 18.46, so 6.46 p.m. Their time is what started this particular cycle here. So, like I said, not quite 11 hours or so, but it's around there. And then we just go from there. Re-upped it. Keep it going and flowing. And that's where it's at. So, again... Uh, I like to show the progression of it, and uh, we go from there. Um, initially, uh, I'll be straight up, I uh, removed my links initially, because, you know, when people voice concerns, and then I started to see a couple of, uh, you know, slower reaction times, I say, you know what, I'm just trying to protect everybody, but... Now that it's kind of been squared away, uh, we'll see how it all goes. So that all the links have been returned back up. And then again, no one's to not, you know, telling anybody what to do. It's really up to you to decide if this is something you like or don't like and go on from there. But so far, this has been a pretty good run for me. And I hope so for everybody else that's involved in it. And so with that, I just want to keep it going and flowing. But if there's any sort of future indicators, you know, in terms of, you know, things going even great, greater than it's going, or or it may, or it may go the other way, then, of course, I always keep you guys informed and updated on what's going on with all that stuff. So, that's everything to talk about in today's video. I'll see you on the next one. Uh, when it's mid-cycle once again for the next CGI update, we'll go on from there. So other than that, comment down below, links down below, do your research. 
and I'll see you next one.